everyone. I'm Cheryl Hamilton, a Stampin' Up! demonstrator from Maui. And today I wanna to show you how I'm going to cut up this piece of 12 by 12 designer series paper. This one's a new one called Fresh as a Daisy. And I'm gonna cut it up and make nine different cards. Now if I cut um, lengthwise at four inches, it's gonna be perfect for my card fronts. So let me just start by doing that. Line it up and Okay, so now I have three four inch links here and there's not much happening at the top. So I'll start with the bottom. So I'm making these four by five and a quarter. So this one's going to be beautiful. Let's see, five and a quarter. Okay, and this will be cute. So I'll, um, I have this one piece left over that I can do something with on another card. <clears throat> so sometimes it's... It's hard to get into these and um, cut these up because <laughs> they're so pretty. But this is it. It may this will make a bunch of really pretty cards. So I'll come back and show you what I do with these. I want to keep these really simple, so I have a regular card base which measures. Let me see, eight and a half by five and a half, and the scored down the middle at four and a quarter. And I've done three of them in boho blue, three of them in copper clay, and I really love these two colors together. Then I'm just gonna dress them up a little bit. I still wanna keep them super simple, but I could use um, some ribbon, and um, I've got a cheerful daisies bundle that might be cute, and I'm just gonna add a few sentiments. Okay, I think I'm done here, and I really like the way these turned out. They're pretty simple. This one's totally simple um, because it had such a pretty image, but I added Winkastella to a lot of the flowers, which it's so hard. There it's showing up a bit. So I added that, and then I found these dots. Let me see. They're called, they, they look like they have the boho blue and the copper clay, and I think that's... Um, lemon lolly or something. It's a really pretty yellow, um, but they're called adhesive back solid gems. Those are really pretty. And um, so I added that to this. This, all I did was stamp in copper clay. And these are, um, the stamps are from Cheerful Daisies. And then I cut out one of the daisies just to add on there, added some sparkle with Wink of Stella. This one is just plain simple. All I did was stamp right on top of the designer series paper with copper clay. Um, this one I've used the double oval punch and stamped, you know, my leftover pieces here. You could make cards with them, but I didn't think there was enough going on on the on either side. Sometimes you'll get a really um, fun polka dot image or something but I just use these um, to dress up these cards a bit. So there's one of mine. Um, brightest birthday, I just decided to use the cloud punch and then I used my leftover piece um, to have an accent cloud. And lastly, I used one of the leftover pieces for a strip across there, stamped on it, you made my day, put a ribbon around it. That ribbon's really pretty. You guys will like that and um, this is one of the dies from the daisy punch so I hope you guys got up some good ideas and I hope you cut your paper all up and make some great cards okay have fun stamping Aloha